Hi everyone, here we've got an Oppo Reno5 and let me share with you how to add the fingerprint to this device. So firstly, let's enter the settings and here we have to find the fingerprint face and password option. As you can see in the biometric section at the very first position, we've got add fingerprint. So let's tap on it. And here we've got the info that we will have to set the lock screen password because it is in case that if the fingerprint sensor won't work, then you will still be able to unlock your device. So let's tap on continue. And here we have to set the screen password. What's more, we can use a different password type. So after tapping here, you can choose also pattern, uh, four digit password, four to 16 digit password and password with four to 16 alphanumeric characters. I will pick the pattern, so simply tap on it. And as you can see right now, I can draw the pattern and redraw it also. Here we've got the tips that uh, if you will use the screen protector, it may affect the fingerprint recognition process. So simply tap on OK. And as you can see here, we've got the fingerprint sensor. So all we have to do is simply tap on uh, our finger on it, put our finger on it. And as you can see right now, we have to do it multiple times in order to add our fingerprint fully and try to catch every corner of it for better recognition, obviously. Okay, right now we have to add the edges, so try to unroll your finger. Okay, and as you can see, we just added our fingerprint, so simply tap on done. Under it, we had uh, also the option to add another fingerprint, but we will be also able to do it using the fingerprint uh, settings. Uh, here we've got also uh, the, um, your device uh, asks you if you want to add the face unlock. I don't want to do that to it right now. So let me get back. And as you can see, we are in the fingerprint settings. So uh, here we've got the fingerprint we just added. We can remove it if you want to just by tapping on the stretch bin icon. But we can also tap on it and rename it. And it's quite a good option if you've got plenty of fingerprints added. So let me um let me rename it just up on the stick uh, i can hear and as you can see it immediately changes what's more here we've got also an uh, add a fingerprint option so obviously you can add uh, much more fingerprints here we've got the option uh, and here we can decide for what we want to use our fingerprint for so simply tap on it and here we've got defaultly set uh, the screen unlock but we can also activate the app lock or private safe it's up to you how you want to set it let me get back and here we've got some customization so here we've got the fingerprint icon animation and after tapping on it we will have uh, eight different options from which we can choose so simply tap on the one uh, you like the most and get back so i will leave maybe this one let's get back and here we've got also the screen of unlock after tapping on it you will be able to decide if you want to show the fingerprint icon on the screen unlock and i will leave it like this so actually this is also the whole customization of the fingerprint so let's lock our device in order to check if it is working and as you can see i hope that you can see it here we've got the um the fingerprint sensor the fingerprint icon so let me put my finger on it and actually it doesn't work okay and as you can see the device is unblocked let me lock it again and put my finger on the sensor and as you can see it works perfectly fine the device is unblocked what's more you will be able also to unlock it using the pattern or pin or password whatever you've chose previously so you will be able to unlock it with it so actually that's all this is how to successfully add a fingerprint in your oppo reno 5 thank you so much for watching i hope that this video was helpful and if it was please hit the subscribe button and leave the thumbs up